Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all doing well. Ramadan well to all of you guys. I hope you guys have amazing and beautiful Ramadan. May Allah answer all of our prayers. Today I'm gonna share with you guys a way. It's one of my favorite food. These are all the ingredients for this recipe. First in the pot, I'm going to add boiling water to help me the cooking process to be fast. Then I will add the dry gray. You can find it some African store, but for me, where I live, I can get this. My mom sent this to me. Thank you, mom. Then what I'm going to do, I'm going to add water. Then to help me, like if it's the fresh one, I will not do this, but the dry one, I have to do this. Then I will add water and I will put it back to the pot straight. Then I will let it boil, but I will add lemon juice. I'm going to add one lemon. If I feel like I need more, I will add more lemon juice too. Then now I'm going to move on to the next step. That's um the cedar no no i don't know other name if you know let me know i know cedar no no i don't know the name how they call it in english it's gonna be power or peanuts i don't know then what i have here i have the boba meal or boba flour whatever you call it then i will add peanut butter i will add peanut butter then what i'm, I'm gonna add hot water one cup of peanut butter and one and a half cup of boba powder. Then I will mix it through. Mix it. I'm going to put the spoon aside and I mix it. While I'm mixing, I will add water to loosen it up. And then adding hot water, mixing it. Then I will add the sugar. Half a cup is one cup, then I use the half and two tablespoons of vanilla, then I have one tablespoon of vanilla here. I'm sorry. <laughs> then I will mix it very well. Then now I'm just going to bring a clay bowl to sift it. It's very simple to make. If you have the powder one, it's simple. I think, yeah, it's more seem easy. Then I will sift it. Um, yeah, I'm just going to clean the bowl, the bowl has some more seasoning no, no. it's one of my favorite, this is my favorite, favorite, I love rui, oh, with seasoning no, no. then I'm going to move on to the rui, then I will add salt, then I will add the sugar, then I will add vanilla extra. I like to flavor my roux. That's how I like it. Then I will let it cook for another 15 minutes. The dry one, you have to cook it quite a while. Um, otherwise, the heat doesn't get through. So, and I'm using the dry one. So that's why I have it cook it for 35 minutes to around 40 minutes. So low heat, it's best. If it's thick, you add water. Now, as you can see, my roux is done after 35 to 40 minutes. Roux is done. Between those time, you have to store it. Check it. Now, the roux is ready. Here is it. I'm going to add the sitan nano. Yeah, if you like this video, give me a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed. I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye.